Is that supposed to be me? Yeah, it's actually supposed to be you getting had to death by a group of angry dwarves. I take it that your friend is right behind me? Get over here. I was going to attack him. You didn't have to signal me. Sorry. Turn that thing off. It's my mom. She calls every day at around this time. You know, the last time I didn't answer it, she sent the state police out to find me. Fine. Answer the phone. Hello? Why, Vaughn? Why'd you do it, huh? Now is really not a good time, Mom. I want to hear from you. I want the truth. Did you kill Vance? No, it wasn't me. Well, thank God, because I was this close to calling the police, man. This close! Y you can do that if you want to, you know. I mean, that would be really cool. So are you guys, you know, a couple? I don't feel comfortable discussing that with a naked, dead stranger. I think I'm just gonna, you know, relax and hope that you never, ever, ever book us into a soul-sucking netherworld like this again. Uh. Oh, jeez! Welcome to the club. What club? The dead guy in the trunk club. I'm not dead. <laughs> well, la-di-da for you. Great. He's awake. Maybe he'll be cool with it, you know? Maybe he'll understand. Right. I mean, it's not like we screwed up the opportunity to get television exposure or anything like that. Oh, wait. You know, that's exactly what we did. Well, I say we uh, let him calm down a little bit and wait to call him tomorrow. Yeah. Or we could talk to him right now. Dennis! You're here! <laughs> hey! Saying anything. Hey, hey, buddy. Your cell phone is off. That's weird. I, I don't know. I must have. When your cell phone is off, it defeats the purpose of the cell phone. The purpose being communication. Cooperation, teamwork. So, when you turn off the cell phone, it's as if you have no cell phone at all. I saw a guitar in the back of your van. Are you kind of like a singer? Figured that one out yourself, did you? No, it was Cindy. She figured it out. I'm observant. It's my gift. Four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves. Selling bonds. And a partridge in a pear tree. I'll tell you what, I'll talk you through it. I, excuse me? Did you just say I'll you would... I'll through what? The appendectomy. Oh, I don't think so. Oh, oh, that is just so, so wrong. I'm not operating on Dennis. Here he is, doctor. Are you a sports fan, Mr. Bundy? Are you a sports fan? Are you a Scotty? What? I don't know anybody named Scotty. No! Scotty! Jay, 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 Jay. Jay, 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 Jay
Oh, come on, guys. I was just having some fun. I was just joking. What am I supposed to be now? Some sort of half-assed detective? I'm suddenly what, Quincy? I'm not Quincy, Jane. I can't do this. How do we do this? I've never tried to solve a murder before. That's all right. I've never been killed before. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. Just let me know when you get to this. Ah. Right. I don't get it. I was sure, 100%, that guy hated me. That's what you said about your pharmacist, and your bank clerk, and your car wash guy. But he didn't even remember me. Nobody remembers you. Not a single person. I'm beginning to think you never even lived in this town. Didn't you hear him? He remembers your order. So what? So what? That's the most progress that we've made all day. You really need to eat something. There's the guy who always ordered that crazy sandwich. His name was uh, Martin Anderson. He used to live around town. I was just wondering if maybe you knew him. Oh my God, you did it. You did it. You killed him. You killed him because you didn't like his sandwich order? Oh, come on, man. Just put down the knife. What the hell happened to you? I soaked my clothes in the toilet as a form of protest. Yeah, some nutball confessed. They found him attacking his guitar player. <laughs> okay, that wasn't me. Hey, Vaughn. Open up. Hey, open up. Hi. Thanks. Hey, I've been looking everywhere for you guys. Wow, well, we're not in the van. Yeah, whatever, watch this. Come on. Go. You suck. Uh, shut up. Die. What? Die. We're going to go right out into the... I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Out into the van outside. Listen, uh, why don't I meet you back at the hotel, the bar there, and like... Uh, Ten minutes after I, I uh, finish up this, uh, this this meeting here. All right. Well, I mean, why don't you just uh, I don't know, like float in there and grab it or whatever. I'm, I'm not Casper, dumbass. I can't touch anything. I can't get the ring. Because if you are willing to walk away from your friends, you are a ghost already. Wait a second. What do you mean ghost already? <laughs> Man, I like I, I've, I've been waiting a long time to tell somebody that. Who are you talking to? Did you feel it? Yes. If autopilot had known, we'd all be dead. Oh, Our speed radar just said we're in exact relation to the glide slope in which the airplane comes into the runway. Glide slope? What? Yeah, yeah. So, see, now this airport is usually like at an angle of three degrees. What the hell are you talking about? Oh, God, maybe I should just uh... push up or push down. Down, down push down. 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 Oh. If you guys are doing drugs, I need to know about it. That is, that is, we're not on drugs, man. Well, then I need to know what the hell is going on here. Okay, I want to know everything. Right now. Uh, okay. Well, so basically, I'm gonna start walking around the club, and then the lights went off, and there was an accident there. Tried to sell it, tried to get rid of it. I still don't even know what it was. I was trying to get it back because I there was like Catholic school. The ambulance went through a giant wall. I'm sorry, but that's what happened. How weird was that? He almost killed me. I was seeing running ghosts. Ghosts, yeah. That's it. Dennis, we're seeing ghosts. Yeah. Ghosts. We're not any happier about the situation than you are. I mean. Yeah. But the pilgrim told me all about it, and I think we can handle it. I'll tell you guys about it later. This first song's going out to our good friends, the problem. So I found this amulet, and I can't get rid of it. Now I feel a bit like Shaggy, but for real. Time I turn around, there's a new ghost to be found From somewhere in the guts of history Now I can't even steal a big record deal I don't think I'll ever be the rock star Are you listening to this? What, this? Yeah, this! This song could be about anyone. 